morning, you degens and perverts. I know you guys enjoyed yesterday's video as you watched it. it turned into what, eight minutes of me and 40 minutes of Ellie and Ellie and Maddie. But it happens. They want to know how to bench, so I'm helping up with that. What, 9.30, we're headed to work. No gym today, but I've already said it a couple of times. We're doing a you know, recovery week, whether you call it a deload or active recovery or whatever. I did a little bit of stuff yesterday while I was helping them out. You know, nothing heavy, just getting moving so they were far more exciting to watch than than me so, that's why you guys got mostly mostly them Saturday we're gonna Saturday we're gonna help again this will be another for sure with Ellie it'll be a bench day um it's Sunday. We're gonna help Ryan with some skits he has planned out. We're gonna play a bully in his little. He's got a idea for a little uh, skit series. So we're gonna do that on Sunday. Today we're gonna make a couple of conveyor belts and then probably take the official last trip out to Goodyear. I mean, it'll be my last trip out to Goodyear, so it'll be our last trip out to Goodyear. But, yeah, it's only two belts. That won't take but 30 minutes. One's a 42, so it's one of the bigger ones. And then one's a 10. So. It'll be super simple. Man. Man, oh man. Yeah, I'm headed to work, so. Maybe I'll record some sh some more belt stuff since it'll be something we will find out all right well this is the last uh, the last weird view probably the last weird view for Dave Co but it is going to be the last um, the last little trip to Goodyear talk so I figured we would have a little chitty chat be bittersweet come Friday Dave's helped me out a lot. And for those of you that enjoyed the dingy dings in my car, here's the dingy dings in this Hinda truck. Because I don't have a little clippy deal to put in my seatbelt. <laughs> so. Oh, man. Yeah. Got those belts made this morning. And uh, now we get to deliver them. And I'll get to finally not have to go back to Goodyear. I used to work there, and it seems like every job I've had since I worked there, I still have to go out there. And it's ridiculous. It is rainy and gross. I mean, I like the rain, but we're definitely not going to be taking the back road all the way, all the way uh, to Goodyear this time, going down to Bishop. We don't want to get the new truck all muddy. I mean, I do, but I don't think they would appreciate it. And uh, I may have to, I may have to see if I can borrow it next week to take Gabriel to his doctor's appointment in the city. So this one or the white one, one of the two. I don't know. I wish I had my other mount so that I could just do a one final, one final drive. I'll do that on my way home on Friday, though. We'll do. 
one final, one final drive, the end of a chapter, on to bigger and better things. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed yesterday's video. It was definitely, I mean, I wasn't in it very much, but it's okay. Ellie, Ellie's going to be really good on bench, I think. I think she's going to get it down real good. Uh, Maddie, I kind of feel sorry for her because her arms are so long. She has so much longer to go on the press. I think she could be good at it, but it's going to be, like, she's going to have to work with as long as her arms are. It's what, you know, when you're short, it's kind of better for that because you don't have nearly as far to go if you have shorter arms. Like, I don't have super long arms, but, you know, I, being as tall as I am, I still have a ways to go. Just like on deadlift, I hate deadlifting because I have to, have well, deadlifts and squats, really. But I have to go so far to hit depth. It's nonsense. I will say we're almost two weeks into no alcohol and I'm feeling better my body's starting to feel better this this week so far you know we're on day three of you know this week of just recovery and I'm already starting to feel better after taking the time off my back doesn't hurt nearly as much my shoulders aren't hurting nearly as much my elbows really just everything in general does not hurt nearly as much as it has been the last couple days. I was able to get out of bed and not feel like my back wanted to, you know, yeet itself from my body. So, that is a plus. And I'm okay with it. <laughs> so. Alright, well. I don't have anything else to talk about right now. So, this was the last, uh, the last hurrah for going to Goodyear with Dave Co. So. There's baby murder chickens. Look at the tiny cobra chickens. Tiny cobra chickens. Wow. Chickens. Did you guys enjoy the the cobra chickens, the little bibbis. The bibbis. Oh, shit. Oh, that's loud in my grass. I bet this has been leaking all goddamn day. Well, maybe not. Dave's going to see old Frank at Corby's on post. And I'm doing my normal routine and going to get the boy. We got the got the official start date and it will be on the 22nd. So next week is going to be hopefully a week of shenanigans and fun adventures before we start at Robinson. So there's that. Let's see what everybody's schedule is like next Saturday I'm trying to figure out on the 27th if I want to if I'm going to go to OKC to the powerlifting meet and just watch or if we're going to go to an SCA thing which is medieval medieval fighting and whatnot for those of you that don't know and watch that because there's one here in town. More than likely, it'll end up being uh, the SCA thing. But starting Robinson on Monday, I will get a check on Friday. So I don't know. We will see. We will find out. But yeah, this will probably be the end of this video. Well, I don't know. I, I, yesterday's video is pretty long. So, I'll probably
probably talk to you guys in the office while I'm editing that. So, obviously, you guys will have seen that already before you see this. So. <sighs> oh, wait, baby. Maybe next week while Gabriel is at school and I don't have to work, maybe we can go do some... We can go shooting. I've got my little Marlin 22 that I haven't, I've had it for years and I've never shot it. It's been shot. It was my adopted grandfather's whenever he passed. But I think I still have some plinking rounds with my pistol for my nine. I'd like to shoot the 38. It hasn't been fired since I got it. It was also my adopted grandpa's. It hasn't been fired either since he passed. So maybe I can make things happen and we'll go do that. We'll do we'll do a little range day maybe. Try to anyways. So next week we'll be back in the gym. So there'll be that. hoping because like I said a little while ago my body already feels better after taking a few days off so I'm hoping that come next week we'll be good and healed and I can see how see how the mid 500s does possibly so should be good I can tell my my chest and shoulders feel fucking amazing today, which is nice because yesterday they were hurting a lot, but they feel great today. So that's a good sign. That's one of the things I've been waiting for to finish being sore since the old 600. So, I don't know. There's a team lift on Saturday. So I'm going to, Saturday will be you know, a bunch of folk. Oh, I'll see you guys in the office.